Now your storm track weather with meteorologist Gabriela Gomez. We saw a few showers earlier this morning and this afternoon, even holding on to some isolated rain this evening. Just overall, a very rainy day ahead for Memorial Day itself. Almost a complete washout as we'll be dealing with some maybe thunderstorms as well. Lingering rain chances for Tuesday and Wednesday starting to dry out towards the tail end of the week, but also warming up to near, near seasonable levels by the time we get to Thursday and Friday. Mostly cloudy skies for Manhattan this evening, also for Emporia. Most spots not dealing with a whole lot of rain right now. Very isolated pockets of rainfall across the area. Sitting at 64 in Topeka, have an easterly breeze at just 5 miles an hour. Most of the region, at least for Kansas and Nebraska, dealing with some below, well below average temperatures for this time of year. 50s for the western half of the state. Our region looking at 63 for Hiawatha and Emporia. Manhattan at 62. 59 for Marysville and Concordia struggling to even get out of the 50s at 55. We'll struggle even more so heading into tomorrow to get out of these 50s and 60s. Well off from average. 60 and 81. Nowhere near that record of 103 by any means. 66 has been our highest. Very close to our average low for this time of year. Started in the 40s this morning may not get as chilly overnight. We'll drop into those middle 50s, holding on to the cloud cover and seeing our rain chances continuing to increase heading towards daybreak tomorrow morning. So those 50s tonight struggling to warm up through the daytime tomorrow, maybe middle 60s at best. It will be a chilly day as we head on into our Monday. Satellite and radar showing those showers really starting to kind of dwindle down in size and becoming more scattered and isolated. That's the first round that we're dealing with. We'll stay dry through really right around midnight or so the middle portion of the night. And then we keep an eye on this next system that's just to our west continuing to fuel in over the Rockies. They are bringing in more rain chances as we head into the daytime tomorrow. We could even hear maybe a few rumbles of thunder as we head towards right around daybreak or so tomorrow morning. Pockets of heavier rainfall definitely possible through the afternoon. A lot of us dealing with the rain through the evening, but it starts to kind of dissipate and move out as we go through just after sunset or right around it. Staying dry throughout the night, maybe a few more isolated showers early Tuesday, lingering on through the afternoon. So tomorrow looks to be the rainiest of the next several. Very isolated rain chances heading through the middle portion of the week, and we could have a few more heading into Wednesday morning. Once Wednesday gets through, we start to dry things out, and we see a lot more sunshine heading towards the tail end of the week. But with this rain, could see half an inch to an inch, maybe some locally higher amounts for some of our western counties that will add to our rainfall totals. But Memorial Day itself, definitely keep that rain in mind as you're having any outdoor festivities. We'll struggle to get into those middle 60s dealing with that rain. Could hear some rumbles of thunder. Nothing looks to be strong to severe, but some thunderstorms nonetheless that you should definitely keep an eye on. We'll struggle to warm up through about midweek, low to mid 70s by the time we get to Wednesday with those rain chances that we're going to be seeing. Very isolated though by the time we get to that point. Heading towards the tail end, more sunshine, seasonable temperatures in those low 80s. And then next weekend rolls around. We go from below average to above average in the middle to upper 80s with a lot more sunshine and maybe a few more rain chances heading on into Sunday. Stay with us. We'll be right back.